Yo, what's up everybody? It's your boy Kwan CB. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome to my channel. No. Hey. 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 <laughs> I'm longing to see. Murderous mind state. Can't keep my knives straight. Sipping on this Tennessee. Waiting for the time to break. Show up in motherfuckers. Bow down. Recognize. West side death row. Outlaw riders. Untouchable mob of pistol packets. Well known fellas. Label for drugs. Selling merciless jackets. Forever buzz. Roll with thugs and dogs. Commits to letting off rounds. Can escape in the fall. Bitches are plenty. Sipping my glass full of hair. What's up, what it is, what's good, what's going on, YouTube? I'm back with another video. Today's video, I'm going to be reacting to uh, Queen Naja and Clarence NYC from Friendships to this No Holding Back. Uh, if you like to really give a thumbs up, if you don't give a thumbs down, y'all know why I really don't care, it's just YouTube. If you want to see more reaction videos or any other videos from me, make sure you guys go on my channel and check out my videos. If you do like my videos on my channel, go ahead and click that, that subscribe button. And also, don't forget to comment down below on what you guys want me to react to or do next so I will get to it. You know what I'm saying? And also, don't forget to um, turn your post on the case to be the first to notify every time when I post a video. And also, don't forget to... Did I say comment down below? I think I did, but if I did, go ahead and comment down below. You know what I'm saying? Also, forget to follow all my social media. It's going to be right here, right here, right here. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, without further ado, let's get into this video. Hold on, wait. Damn. What's up, Royal family? What's up, y'all? Yeah, I miss y'all so much. Am I reading you? So, a lot of you guys probably looking at this video and you guys thought, I don't know what to do. I don't know Video. Today's video is to talk about why we they sure is doing a lot of cutting. They cut a lot of shit out. And how we turn from friends into what we are now. As y'all know, me and Queen are together. And uh, we, we moved in as we previously announced. It's. <laughs> you know, you I'm like, trying to put my stuff together like put, put it in my head. You sound like somebody's uh, granddad about to get a lecture. We all knew that that's how I was talking. <laughs> like, it was obvious. Put in words. A lot of people say like, oh you guys are moving too fast or you guys are going is. too fast. Y'all is. But I feel like uh, this whole time people tried to rush us. People tried to rush us to confirm. Y'all went along with it. Because I don't know if it's like y'all love this thing, y'all love like couple goals and relationship goals and all that kind of stuff because of social media, but that's not what it's about. So, um, like we just really didn't we didn't want to rush into staying in the thing, and people was getting frustrated with us. Like, oh my God, y'all need to date already, or y'all need to tell us if y'all need to Y'all shouldn't even go along with the people saying. Like, like a cop chasing. Yeah, I think Because that's... I wasn't confirming anything or like. Or like saying anything. Like, like cleaning me. Yeah, or going as fast as they wanted me to. Yeah. Like, you know, but like, I've always told Queen, like, like, I said this before, but me and Queen has always been on the same page, like, every throughout every step of, like, the whole journey. I, I know I've been honest with you. I've been honest with you, too. Oh, from, like, from the real. So now that we are, like, in a relationship, we've confirmed it with everyone. It's a lot of people that are saying that we move too fast. Y'all did. There's a lot of people that are saying, like, you see that? Mm -hmm. And it's a lot of people also saying that, like, um, like, this is too much for them that we have to slow down. Well, I just want to say, truthfully, like, this may be really, you okay? Yeah, I'm trying to keep <laughs> This may be, like, new to y'all, but it's not really new to us. We, we knew that. On a low, low for a we were, like, affectionate behind closed doors. We know that? Yeah, so when y'all say, oh, Clarence don't care for her, or Clarence don't show as much of affection, like, like he was showing affection, but it just wasn't for the camera. camera. And I'm not used to doing that on, like, on camera. You know? Yeah. I understand but, it. Like, so now y'all know, you know, we do like do more stuff on camera. Like we kiss, like we're a little bit more comfortable on camera. But I don't want it to turn into like a social media relationship. I just want y'all to enjoy, enjoy 
our love that we have for each other and whatever we show towards each other it's natural it's not ever like for the camera like oh let me kiss you for the camera let me yeah. like it's because well sometimes i just like want to kiss you everything that we do is like um we really like me organic it's organic and if it happens on camera it just happens we don't do it for the camera get mm. it like i do a child so um we wanted to tell you guys the story on how it led to this and how it went from actually being a friendship to Come a relationship on, or how he knew that it was more than just a friendship. Um, and it happened around a particular time when um, I was staying with Claire for a little bit and we were, we were always together, like we were sleeping in the same bed. Like, we was doing videos together, and we was, like, really just, like, always, you know, watching movies together, and we was, like, just getting really close and just spending a lot of time together, getting to know each other's personalities and everything like Every that. Every day. So, one time, I left for, I left for, yeah, mama. Huh? Mama, mama yeah. was trying to get me to fly out there. Oh, yeah, I left for a trip to Miami. I took my mom to Miami for her birthday back in April, and, um, that's, that's the trip that's the time that we realized that we that it was more than just a friendship that we meant a lot more to each other than what, yeah, we, what thought. we thought like sometimes like it's so true like sometimes when you um like when you have something every day or when you're like when when you see something or or obtain something every day you kind of lose not lose but like like you don't know what you got you don't know what it is until you lose it like you don't know how bad yeah it is. I, I know what y'all saying until they, they basically you saying don't you don't know, yeah. know so how that person what the, what that person is to you until they gone you know man okay so it's weird yeah i did go to mind for like about like a whole like past the week but we it had only been three days so we start texting one night and this is where it gets juicy so we was texting one night and I was basically telling him like, dang, it's only three days and I miss you like crazy. And he was like, yeah, I miss you too. It was like, my, you said my days haven't been the same Yeah. without you. You was like, my sleep haven't been the same. Like, I think it was much different. Like, I, I think we spent like probably like. Well, they got they got too comfortable. Like, See, he got used to being around. Three days, and I was like, why do I feel like I left you for like three weeks? I was more weeks. confused. He was more confused. I was more confused because it's about like, what? In my head, I was kind of like, I, I don't want to say fighting it. You were fighting it. Kind of fighting it, like because yeah. it's like I wasn't sure how or why this was happening. You know, like or why. Like you were happy in it, you know. Mm -hmm. Like I, I've been. She had a crush on you. It was obvious, though. Like I, I, I was love. Like I love someone else, and mm -hmm. I just got out of a relationship. Yeah, me too. I just not that I wanted to be with that person, but just. How could you love someone else so you, quick? Yeah, like how could you love someone else so quick? So know? this is the part where we found. Because they follow the looks, duh. Because we was the same time we was texting. We just started, like, I don't know. It, the conversation just got a little deeper. And he was like, you know, my day didn't been the same without you. And so I started. Okay. Okay. I was like, it's only been three days. Oh, it's only been three days. It's only been three days. He said, tell me about the love. Okay, so we went to talk to each other, how much we miss each other and all that stuff. And then he said he was confused. So then he asked me. I said, why you cut that part out? You was just in love with someone that's different from me. What yeah, makes Chris, you so wow. sure Chris is wow. I just felt like whenever it came to like, I was just, just trying to prevent myself for. No, you was fighting it. Yeah, no, you was fighting. fighting. She answered Shari the whole thing. She said, Claire, that, that. I fell out of love a long time ago. But with you, you have enough. Oh. This is what I'm she said, but with you, like, you're very different from what I'm used to. I'm not used to someone really pushing me to love myself. Mm. And not one time have I ever seen you get big headed, even though you could be. I fell in love with your humbleness and realness. You don't go out in the crowd doing too much. 
and looking for too much. Like, that's Chris. Chris. <laughs> what the heck? Oh, okay. Oh, because you have a comment on and still than you already. And you're just so, so much, much more mature. mature, and you're a man. And I never had a man. I always had boys. You never Chris told me the truth. Boy. Always told the truth. I don't know. Every day well, was spent, I tried Chris to fight. Like I really did. He mature. He way mature than Chris. I can't tell you I'm perfect at all. I can't tell you that I won't get on your nerves or have the best attitude sometimes. But I know that I have unconditional love and loyalty. I always give 100%. Okay, so he, he proceeds to say, um, this isn't funny. Because I gotta kind of like read it and think about your voice. Want me to read my voice? I can read it. Okay, he said, baby girl, I, baby girl, he said that hurts my whole heart just like melted. But anyway, baby girl, I think you deserve so much. I don't want you to look at me. Please stop. Stop. Don't look at me. Please. You make me like real. Okay, he said, baby girl, I think you deserve so much, and I want you to have it all. You're going to be legendary, and. <laughs> okay. And I'm glad I've been a part of the process. Your heart makes me want to give you everything you asked for. I never want to say no to you. You just deserve it. You deserve to step on that thing but gold queen. Make sure you remember that. Never let anyone make you feel different. I look at you now and I see a woman that's successful and independent and she comes with spice. It turns me on. <laughs> queen, something about you. Keeps my eye on you. Stop it, because you know you you never see me do that. Like for real. The fact you behind me and so down for me, I love. All right. So mm. after that message, I guess he went back to the part when I was like, I have unconditional love, and you know, like. So he said, "So you think you love me?" And I was like, um. This is so embarrassing to me. I hope people don't. It's not embarrassing. It's not embarrassing. You're a grown ass woman. You do what okay. the fuck you want to do. So he was like, So you think you love me? And I was like, um, No. I was like, I know I love you. Oh, you know. I was like, I know I love you. I'm sure. <laughs> I was sure, like, for real. I was like, I know when I love someone. You know, and, um, and I was like, Truthfully, like, even if you don't say it, like, I really don't. Like, I'm, I'm, I'm not going to say something just because you said it. I'm going to say it because I actually feel it, and it's real. And that's what I meant, you know, even if you don't feel that way. So then he told me. Then he told me, I love you, queen, and something else and this and that. But that love, I take that, I take that, that, that love. I love you shit too. And that's too, the first too, time you ever Too that. hard. And if I say they um, love me, I, I don't like, really believe that. He didn't, he didn't want, he's kind of scared because he didn't like want nothing to get ruined. Because, you know, stuff changes like after, you know, stuff changes Some, after. Sometimes like, when you put a title on stuff. When you put a title on stuff, it changes. So, you know, like we both confirmed to each other that we love each other at that moment. And we Queen decided been feeling clear, at that though. point that we were Since just going to continue our friendship. We didn't jump into nothing or right in the mirror just because we said we love each other. We yeah. knew that we loved each other. I think I said after that, I think I said, like, like I love you, Queen, but like, let's continue. Let's continue to build our friendship and, you know, you know, oh, real man, our, dude. like, work I on slew, our relationship. I slew Clarence for that. At first, I was like, mm -mm, you know, I won't fuck, I won't fuck with Clarence at first. Out. And so, from that part, like, from there, like, when I got back, we just, like, kind of grew, like, much more closer much in closer. an intimate way. Mm. And it was, like, more, like, affectionate. I think if y'all go back, you have to actually see that. Like, Is that what I can't I don't back? watch the y'all videos. I don't watch their videos. All right, all right, boy. I'll put you on. He bought me the Gucci slides. you told me you didn't have any sandals. Yeah, and it's, yeah, I, I told him that I didn't have no sandals. In Miami, like not no Gucci yeah, And so he thought about me after that, and and um, bought me Gucci slides. So after that, we got more like comfortable with each other, but we still didn't confirm nothing. We was like, 
on the low, just like talking and stuff like that. We can do that. You know, just only me and you. Yeah, only me and him knew. Not like, even like Patty and Phil. Yeah, Patty and Phil, they didn't even know, but we were so low because. It was obvious though. It was so obvious good. though. Like, was Put two pieces me. together. We it was done. I'm like such a private person, and I just like I'm a firm believer. Like if nobody knows what's going on, nobody could try and ruin it. Yeah. I feel, like I feel you with that. Nah, you right. But I don't. I think we was just such a like. A, we wanted to be sure too. Yeah, sure. Like, I don't like. I don't want to take something on social media and then like don't mean it or like. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah, we wanted to wait till we were like. Well, I was sure at the moment. Like I was sure how I felt about him. I think you were sure how you felt about me, but you wasn't sure if you. You wasn't sure where it was gonna go because you know how you tell somebody how you feel about them, then they get comfortable. Yeah. And then, like, they switch up. Yeah. I don't know if y'all was going to switch up, uh, but, mm. but I didn't. In the beginning, I mean. I feel it. So. Like, even before I told you I love you, like, I cared about you. Yeah, like, you I cared, said you was like, there. Like, I, I cared about you. But, like, my only thing was, like, like, you came out of something also. And, like, it, was, it wasn't. Was it, but it wasn't. I ain't gonna shit back clowns. You know, like until you got married, and it was I like, see him on social media, a lot of us have paid attention to him. Yeah. Like, you know, I want, from your sake too, like, I want you to be sure, like, like, you like me too, you know, because there's something, now, you know what I mean, like, when you first got out of a relationship, you just like, you got to say You can be like, just talk to anyone, and, you got to think of me You can be vulnerable, and maybe like that's why you like them because they make you feel good at this time so basically you need it, what you know you're saying is you didn't know that what everybody thought like. when he said everybody was thinking the same thing everybody thinks she went to that. Clarence for a rebound that's what everybody thought she was to Clarence for I know you told me that I know you told me that that's why I was still friends I told you I was right that's not right but you told me that but you also probably he wanted to get to that drama shit I'm not understanding that but I didn't say but how do you know I ain't expect this to happen either. Like, I ain't expect to love you either. Like, I ain't, you know what I'm yeah. saying? But y'all be around each other a lot, duh. But you ain't like her vibe. Duh, I ain't gonna fall in love with each other. Yeah, I'm not saying right? it's not. I don't regret anything. I just, I did. It was very unexpected. Uh, yeah, like, I did it. We like, literally got together just to do a collab video. That's all it was supposed to be. I keep telling the clip, but I still like him as like Queen, but you said that she like, yo, he was on Instagram crush. After just so, spending all the time with each other, we we just got closer and just a lot of things was going on behind closed doors that y'all didn't know about. And we didn't want to we didn't want to let it be known. Just because you keep something private don't mean you hiding it. Yeah, we're not we're not hiding it from you guys, just No, we didn't hide it from you guys. We didn't hide it. It's just we wanted we wanted to keep it. So much contradiction. Really, I was just okay. I didn't care if y'all knew about anything. I was okay as long as I knew me and him was like seeing eye to eye. Like that's better than being in a relationship on social media and y'all look like y'all love each other, mm -hmm. but behind closed doors, like, mm -hmm. like is there no affection? That, that could have been it too, you know? Because like now, at the point where we're right now, like. I'm comfortable with you. Yeah. Like, like I, I trust you, and I like, I feel like we're on the same page. Yeah. You know? Like I feel like we are. So it's, I think waiting and being patient was like. Being patient is the best thing ever. Being friends first is the best thing ever. It is. It Honestly, is. Like, I could tell y'all that one of the mistakes I probably did make in my last. I wasn't friends first with the person. So like Chris, that's say his name, Queen. Chris. To, like really take steps. Well, you don't have to rush into stuff all the time. It it comes out a lot better when you don't rush. Yeah. That's um, true. But this thing here I feel is really genuine. And you know, I really don't care what other people say. I don't care if people say that we just doing it for the camera because at the end of the day it was understood to me. Me and him doesn't really need to be explained to you guys. Like, only time will tell. But, um. And it's us against the world, right? Yeah. So, yeah. So, I'm not saying, like, we don't, we don't care about what you guys think or anything, but, like, it's 
just it we is. know how we feel about each other. Exactly. Nobody can change it's that. Me and her, you know, and that's like like her opinion is the one that matters to me the most, and not er, like anybody else's. Yes, thank you. So with that being said, the past few weeks are, are, for us have been really rough. Um, and honestly, they been really rough for you. Yeah. And this is this is gonna be. <laughs> you mean the past few months? Like now, nah, yeah. I'm telling the past few weeks have been oh, hard yeah. for you as a, as an artist and as a person, mm -hmm. like doing all these things and. Queen and biz, I've been really saying that. I don't anything. follow Clarence. I follow Queen. It's just been really I, hard. I don't find Clarence is so boring to me. You're really like. A but he seen that he cool, but he bored as hell to watch. And I don't know how you do it, but you do. Yeah, so you're strong. I look, I, I've been been a supporter of Queen I since Chris and Queen you, met you, before you. that, when she was when she first started singing. Stop! <laughs> I love you. Too. I love you. I love you too. Oh, I love you too. Just want to say it's my first time yeah, seeing <laughs> It's my first time seeing them kiss on camera. Like what? Yeah. You're such a like you're such a like a good one. Thank you. You look you look good man too. Um And just if that being said, we 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 don't wanna hide we don't wanna hide things from you guys anymore. Okay. We wanna be transparent and um with that being said there's one there's one more thing. One more thing. One more, one more thing that we don't wanna hide. What's from the thing? Because we you know, we feel that it's unfair. Mm. And it's not something that's that should be hidden. hidden. Come on, she pregnant or what? What? I'm just going to show you guys the next clip. And we're going to end the video. And we will be back. Get the fuck out. Wow. Get the mm -mm. what? I'm confused. So he got her pregnant. So they've been fucking for a minute. Mm -hmm. We, but we, it's so funny though. We been knew that that they were fucking though. We been knew that it was obvious. We want some. Most of us wasn't glad to see what was going on. That's because y'all don't say nothing. We always see the, the chemistry between y'all two. Duh. <laughs> Duh. Real people see real things. We see we see right through it. But damn. But congratulations to her though. To them. Dang. Baby, if you ever have a baby brother and a sister. But I know some people are going to be like, um, oh, she, not, she, she don't even watch baby CJ, so she got to watch another one. But so what though? That's congratulating them. Move the fuck on. They they living their best life. Congratulations to them. Damn. I, I'm praying for for a girl this time. For real. But congratulations to them. Damn. But you guys just really give a thumbs up. If you don't give a thumbs down, cause y'all know why we don't catch it. If you want to see more reaction videos or any other videos for me, for me, make sure you guys go on my channel and check out my videos. If you do like my videos on my channel, go ahead and click that subscribe button. You know what I'm saying? Also, don't forget to comment down below what you guys want me to react to the next time we get to it. I always say that already. I'm starting repeating myself. Don't forget to turn your post notification. And also, don't forget to follow all my social media. Right here. Right here. Right here. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, subscribe. I'll see you guys in the next video. I love y'all.